nothing like a fresh haircut at Studio 109. Well, it's been a while since since we last did a Risty's Guide, and I apologise for that. I've been having some thoughts about what the next Risty's Guide could be. Actually, it came to me in a dream, and you'll see what's coming up when I tell you we're going to have some tasty treats and some succulent, delicious beverages of a certain kind. Yes, it's the Ale Trail. Yeah, a few Ale tokens. They're opening a Sainsbury's in my local area. Hopefully, they'll be stocking some mighty fine ales. If Jesus' blood was wine, then surely Mary Magdalene's must have been ale. Let's get the eat. That was ale. Gotta find some ale. Oh, I can smell them. They're somewhere. Somewhere near. No, this isn't a scene from Michael Mann's Miami Vice. We're in ale country. Old versus new. Ales versus lagers. Corporate entities versus socialist ideals. Who will win? I don't know. Cheap and delicious. some people make. Not all ales are dark and foamy and nut brown. Some are golden and light. Like the summer ales, such as this one, which is called God's, God's Salvation. It's delicious and smooth. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Lovely. Bishop's Finger, Guzzler, Old Tongham Tasty, Figgy's Brew, Snowflake, Black Magic Miles, Moth Bag, Hidden Pleasure, Speculation, Christmas Quacker, Cocky Hop. Yeah. Oh, I'm feeling a bit dizzy. I've got to get out of here. Things that piss, and they should really get some proper toilets. I've just been on the phone to Timothy Taylor. 
He told me mighty fine ales. Well, I've had a lovely evening. I've sampled some delicious ales, but I've got to go now. I'm feeling a little bit sick. Jeez! Chris has been hit. Chris, what's, what's going on? He's been got. What do we do? Um, do you, no, just leave he's him. He's not really leaving.